माइनस फिफ्टीन सेकेंड फ्रॉम वचन से पंद्रह सेकेंड की दूरी पर टेन नाइन एट सेवन सिक्स फाइव फोर थ्री टू वन जीरो Bright morning of the New Year's Day, made brighter by a majestic liftoff. PSLV C58 carrying India's X-ray polarimetric satellite towards its destination. जी हाँ इस वर्ष का प्रथम प्रमोशन श्रीहरि कोटा के प्रथम प्रमोशन मंच से PSLV C58 का हमने सफलतापूर्ण उत्थापन देखा और यह अपनी उद्दिष्ट कक्षा की ओर निरंतर बढ़ता हुआ प्रथम चरण का निष्पादन पूरी तरह सामान्य Nominal thrusting by PS1 stage. Nominal burn time for the strap-ons is 70 seconds, and the core motor for 109 seconds. इस समय यान अपने अधिकतम गतिक दाग से गुजरता हुआ प्रथम चरण का कुल प्रज्वलन काल 110 सेकंड का होगा तत्पश्चात इसे यान से पृथक कर दिया जाएगा. Sharp tracking station currently tracking the flight. Ground lift strap-on separated. दोनों strap-ons को यान से पृथक कर दिया गया है तथा core booster अभी भी प्रज्वलित है. Presently the core S139 motor alone thrusting. The strap-ons have been separated. Normal. This stage will carry the rocket to 57 kilometers altitude. And add 1.6 kilometers per second as a relative velocity. इस घटना क्रम पे अगला है प्रथम चरण का प्रतिकन तथा द्वितीय चरण का प्रज्वलन. First stage separated. Second stage engine started. Close loop guidance initiated. जी हाँ इसकी पुष्टि हो चुकी है प्रथम चरण को सफलतापूर्वक यान से प्रतिक किया गया है. और द्वितीय चरण का प्रज्वलन शुरू हो चुका है दिस अ कंफर्मेशन फ्रॉम द रेंज ऑपरेशन डायरेक्टर दैट द सेकंड स्टेज हैज कमेंस्ड इट्स ऑपरेशन सेकंड स्टेज परफॉर्मेंस नॉर्मल एज द ऑल्टीट्यूड राइट नाउ इज ऑलमोस्ट एट द वर्ज ऑफ द डेंस एटमोस्फेयर क्लोज लूप गाइडेंस हैज बीन इनिशिएटेड द नेक्स्ट फ्लाइट इवेंट इज इगरली अवेटेड The next flight event is payload fairing separation. द्वितीय चरण का निष्पादन सामान्य है इसका कार्यकाल एक सौ बावन सेकेंड का होगा और इस दौरान यह कुल आठ सौ किलो न्यूटन का प्रणोद उत्पन्न कर यान को उद्दिष्ट दिशा की ओर ले जाता है इसकी पुष्टि हो चुकी है उष्मा कवच को यान से पृथक कर दिया गया है There is a confirmation of payload fairing separation and a nominal thrusting by the second stage of PSLV. द्वितीय चरण तरल नोदक पर आधारित चरण है इसमें UDMH और N2O4 को ईंधन की तरह इस्तेमाल किया जाता है वर्तमान में विकास इंजन नामक इस द्वितीय चरण के इंजन द्वारा प्रणोद उत्पन्न किया जा रहा है By the time PS2 completes its operation, the altitude of the launch vehicle will be 161 kilometers and relative velocity of 4.5 kilometers per second. Current altitude close to 150 kilometers. Second stage performance normal. Plus four minutes. यान पूरी तरह अपेक्षित पथ का अनुकरण करता हुआ शार्ज ट्रैकिंग स्टेशन कंटिन्यूज टू ट्रैक ऑल राइट सो माई कॉलिक धारिणी इज जॉइनिंग अस लाइव ऑन द ब्रॉडकास्ट लेट मी गो अक्रॉस टू हर धारिणी इंडिया फर्स्ट मिशन फॉर 2024 ट्वेंटी फोर टू स्टडी द एमिशन मेकेनिज्म फ्रॉम द ब्लैक होल्स एव सक्सेसफुली लिफ्ट इट ऑफ फ्रॉम द फर्स्ट लॉन्च पैड एट सतीश धवन स्पेस सेंटर एट श्री हरिकोटा ब्रिंग अस ऑल द डिटेल्स
Well, definitely indeed a very big day for ISRO on the very first day of the year itself. Uh, the ISRO has, uh, uh, you know, uh, uh, put into space uh, uh, ExpoSat, that is X-ray polarization satellite. And, you know, just a few moments back, uh, P a PSLV carried the satellite, you know, into the space. And within the next 20 minutes, we are expected to uh, find out the result of this mission, whether it's, it's a success or not. And, uh, you know, shortly from now, uh, ISRO will also hold a press conference and they'll announce whether this mission is a success or not. But definitely talking about the mission... Uh, this mission will mark, uh, you know, India's first, uh, you know, uh, scientific endeavor to study, uh, 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 scientific endeavor to study the uh, um, uh, uh, the polarization of cosmic X-rays from celestial objects. Uh, precisely, like this spacecraft will study uh, black holes and neutron stars, you know, in general. Uh, so, uh, you know, uh, the inside of the black hole is something that's very tough to study, and no, uh, no space organization has done it to a great extent so far. But even now, even this uh, mission. This will uh, study the outer, you know, surface of black holes uh, through the X-ray emissions that are happening, you know, out of it. Uh, so definitely, uh, uh, these are, uh, you know, uh, these are some of the most enigmatic features of the universe. And you know, the human kind do not have a great understanding about how a black hole operates or how a neutron star is like, you know, born and died. So definitely, these are uh, some of the most enigmatic features of this universe. And whatever the data that we are able to get out of this mission, uh, this is going to help us build on our, our future missions. That is something that we can say for sure. And uh, at sharply around 9, 10 a.m., uh, a PSLV rocket uh, put uh, Exposat successfully, you know, into the space. And the official announcement about the successful address of this mission will be uh, announced by the, uh, you know, uh, the ISRO scientists themselves, you know, shortly from now on. But definitely, uh, you know, uh, public also came in large numbers to the Satish Dhawan Space Center in Shrigiri Koda to witness this launch in person. Uh, they were sitting over in the public gallery, you know, here. Uh, uh, so uh, definitely after, uh, you know, last year was a very great year for ISRO in terms of launches. Okay. We had, uh, you know, Chandrayaan-3 uh, smooth landing on the lunar surface and we also had, you know, Aditya right. L1, you know, uh, uh, being put into the space right. successfully. But after these two mega missions, now we have this, uh, you know, uh, uh, this ExpoSat mission on the very first day of the new year itself. All right, Dharani, appreciate you joining us uh, and uh, bringing us those details at this point there. Uh, the launch was in fact su successful and we are also getting you uh, these uh, visuals. It is in fact uh, the first project, the first mission of ISRO in the year 2024. We will be tracking in all the developments but uh, dipping into a short commercial break.